This video will show how our Navigator, Test Suite Pro, and DTM tools are used in the IEC 61850 engineering process. SCL Navigator is a Windows application for visualizing, verifying, and repairing IEC 61850 system configuration language files. It can also be used by IED vendors to create ICD files for their devices. SCL Navigator contains a 61850 AWARE editor that provides a structured environment for compliant SCL file editing. It can be used each time a new SCL file is generated to inspect the new file for changes, check for errors, and repair any issues that may prevent the next tool from processing the file. The Navigator icon shows each time it can be used in the 61850 engineering process. The conceptual phase is an iterative process where the system configuration tool creates an SCD file which DTM uses to simulate all of the IEDs in the substation and create automated tests to confirm individual device behavior. Test Suite Pro is a diagnostic tool that uses this SCD file to monitor, troubleshoot, and confirm the behavior of the new substation design simulated in DTM. Workspace is created in both DTM and Test Suite Pro during the conceptual phase can be reused over the life of the substation to evaluate changes to the substation design or the specific equipment installed. At factory acceptance testing, some of the simulated IEDs in DTM are replaced by actual IEDs in the lab. These IEDs have been programmed by their corresponding IED configuration tool with the same SCD file used by DTM to simulate the missing IEDs. The Test Suite Pro and DTM workspaces created in the conceptual phase are now used to monitor, troubleshoot, and confirm the behavior of the newly added IEDs. Automated tests created in DTM for a template substation can be used to validate each new SCD file and behavior of the corresponding IEDs prior to commissioning each new substation. During commissioning and ongoing maintenance in the substation, the Test Suite Pro workspace created with DTM during the conceptual and factory acceptance phases is used to validate the behavior of the substation. Once the substation is operational, the conceptual and factory acceptance testing phases can be reused during the life of the substation to evaluate changes to the substation design or the specific equipment installed without taking the substation out of service. The DTM workspace may also feed a second SCADA system used for operator training to simulate catastrophic conditions. For more information about our products or general questions about 61850, please contact us using one of the methods in the description below. Thank you.